Solving trigonometric equations, question 4. Determine approximate solutions to the nearest hundredth radian for 4 tan x minus 5 equals to 0, where x is greater than or equal to 0 and less than or equal to 2 pi. So let's try to solve this equation. So we have 4 tan x minus 5 equals to 0. So we can simplify this. And we can say, well, 4, 4 tan x equals to 5, or tan x equals to 5 over 4. Okay, 5 over 4, right? So tan x is 5 over 4, which is positive. Tan is positive in two quadrants. Which are those two quadrants? The quadrants are quadrant 1 and quadrant 3. How do we know that? from the cast rule, C-A-S-T. So tan is positive in quadrant 3 and all are positive in quadrant 1. Got it? Now, we need to find what x is. So x is equal to tan inverse of 5 by 4. Now, since the domain is from 0 to 2 pi and it is in radians, we should find all our answers in radians. Got it? That's kind of important. And to do that, we need a calculator. So with calculator, we'll put it in the mode radian and do tan inverse of within bracket 5 divided by 4. Bracket close and we get 0 0.8960. 0 0.8960. And you can round this to the hundredth place, which is this place. So it becomes 0 0.90 hundred place. But we got only one answer. How do we get the next answer? That's a big question, right? Many times I have seen students only writing one answer and they get half the marks. The other answer is in this quadrant. Think like this. Let us say that the tan is kind of here, right? That is in quadrant 1. And you need to find this angle also. Angle, we mean principal angle when you measure from the positive x-axis. So that is the angle which you have already got in radians. And the other one is this. How much is that? So what we will do for that is we'll, we'll say, well, the principal angle x is this. Relative, actually speaking, it is a related acute angle, correct? Fortunately, tan was positive. So that is also part of our solution set. So one angle is x equals to 0 0.8960. The other angle should be pi plus that much, right? So the other solution is x can be equals to, so we have two solutions, and x equals to pi plus 0 0.8960, right? So what we will do is we will add pi to this. And write down our answer. That gives us a value of 4.0376. And this can be rounded to the hundredth place, which is this place. So it is 4.04 .04 radians, right? So now we can write down both the solutions. So our solution is x is equal to approximately 0 0.90 and 4.04 .04 radians, okay? That is how we are going to write the solution for this particular trigonometric equation. Thank you.